Welcome to Factorio Train World. My name is Nilaus and this is episode 20 of our Let's Play campaign. So 20 sounds like it's uh, it's a lot. 20 episodes already. Yeah, but you know, we are barely getting anywhere because this is a big base and it's just, this is always like the, the issue when you make a Let's Play. So many Let's Plays, you can, you can get them done in 20 episodes, but Factorio, you just can't get it done in less than 50 if you even want to launch a rocket without you cheating some way or another. Which is also why it's just difficult to make uh, stuff like um, C block, for example, because it'll take 200 hours or 200 episodes at least. So what do we want? Well, we have our slowly but surely. What is this? This is 680. Should we just uh, send it off to our labs there until empty? Let's uh, actually no, let's not. And I wish I had a train, a car somewhere. Uh, okay, that got left over here so i actually want to hey let's say traffic jam left how's our power power looks fine ish oh yeah it's it's catching up okay yeah that's that's actually good that is good i need to get over here Ugh, i wish we could run some fa run faster here but uh, alas that is not a thing that we can do so we want to do some military science because our way biggest issue we could expand so much faster if we didn't have to bother with the biters but unfortunately that is the way of life biters are the way of life well actually that's only one person who thinks biters are the way of life but uh that's uh another story what we will do is we will get from here these oh look at that that's a whole lot of not pathing let's get some pathing up here Hmm. Why? Why? Boom. Let's get that one done. Wow, that's a lot of mistakes like that. No. There you go. That should be fine. And now I can take this one. We can send it off. Go. Oh, how much do we got? 708. Well, it's not a lot, but it's going to be something. And once it's something, then it's going to be something we get. Great. So we have Blue Science is working, operational. And that means the next thing is actually we need to get some military science and I am driving everything everywhere except for the path that's just typical me isn't it and hold on we are here all right there are two ways to do it the right way and the wrong way so which one are we going to do the wrong way I'm sorry but I kind of have to uh, the reason is I want to build the military science but if I am to build the military science it has to be built here military science requires three inputs like so many other things Piercing rounds, grenades, and walls. Walls could be argued that we can make them locally, but if you want to make grenades locally and piercing rounds locally, then it would require, for piercing rounds, it's iron, copper, steel, plus coal, plus uh, stone bricks. That's five items inbound. And if we look at the location, yeah, this wall could take it actually could, it actually could take five inbound damn it it can't take five inbound damn my excuse excuse for not doing it is invalidated immediately hmm. all right well um so much for that that means we are actually going to do it because i did i kind of validated my own excuse my excuse was that it couldn't get five items inbound so we will get five items inbound and let's see that one will be a t intersection yeah, it's going to mirror this one. So that's going to be a T intersection. This one and this one will be actual builds and that one. Boom. And here as well will be boom. Okay. And then we have. Wow, look at the science. It's just crazy. Going absolutely crazy. And here, uh, it's going to be, I was about to say it's going to be difficult, but it's actually going to be super easy because we can see where things are already. And then we need to go up here just to make sure that we get all of the things inbound. Okay, so that's a thing. Uh, let's start by taking this out. Yep. And then let's take 
this out. Yeah, okay, so now we actually have the possibility to grab things inbound and send stuff out. What else do we want? We want flow, flying speed, sure. We want capacity sides, might actually be nice as well. Um, personal robo port would be nice and Hold on, if we can now uh, if we give a personal robot port, then I can actually get better than this. How much do we got here? We got 10 plus 10. We could make a modular armor, couldn't we? Yep. Could we make a power armor? Yeah. Not really. This one requires something else. Power armor. Yeah, we could make power armor, but that still requires blue circuits. So why is it power armor? Why is that here? That's way out of reach. But we could still get maybe something better. I mean, this one has exceedingly good power supply. 150. I wish we could get more of those. Now we could also get more of those tiny ones. And that's something I have completely forgotten. Um, we could easily upgrade. What does it do? Not much. Bonus inventory and bonus inventory. Yeah. Okay. That's, that's actually okay. Great side five by four, five by four. And I suppose the other one is also five by four. All right, so what should we do? I mm, don't like it. Well, I don't like. Okay, the first thing we need to do is get the last teeny tiny bits of the stone bricks brought into a location. That means it's down here. And that means it needs to be here. All right. Okay, worker speed. Do I want to build something more? I think I'll just hold back on it because I think that what I really want to do is that one and then that one and then we need the military science as well so where could we get see i want to save these this could also and should probably also be uh i don't know deprecated seems to be the wrong word for this but um let's uh take all of this out just while we're at it i'll take these these are the worst ones Look at this. We're actually using our logistics bots now. And what we can also do is we can do one of these and then just put crap in there. Actually, that, not that crap. That crap goes in my car. And then once I get away from this area, then I can schedule it for deconstruction. Whoops, that, that one. There. Once I pick these up, it's going to be no problem at all. Except that I've already like assigned way too much to to my construction bots, right? Have I? How many? Ooh, power again. Power! No! Okay, uh, I think I have a tiny suspicion why we're running out of power. Uh, this one and that one, they could and should probably be... I'm just wondering where... Oh, you know what? That's an intersection. That's a, a corner. Could we not take that corner? And we do have the corner here for us, that one. We could just put it here, right? Yep, we could. So take that one out and that one. Ta-da. This one. That goes out. That goes out and that goes out. Nope. Trees in the way. And that one is not going to do and that one is going to be fine. Okay, so that's, I mean, it's not going to help us just now. Uh, we can take this part here. As long as it doesn't include any robo ports. Oh, sorry, any radars, then it should be just what we need here. I'll take these two out and then copy it in. 
like so. Good. That's going to help us a bit. And that one is unfortunately still problematic. And we can still, and we should still get the rest of this. Like that. Somehow these are just not emptying fast enough. This was not what I intended, to be honest. And if I just kill my own robots, there we go. And then I can take these two out, this one and this one. This should be now be transferred to somewhere else. And that one goes out. And now I can, <clears throat> in somewhat good conscience, take no I actually I can I can take this and just accept the fact that it's not gonna work right so this is how it should be boom but I can take all of this out because it's relevant it's only really the top one we need and you know, any any of the things on this side is actually relevant. That one, that one can stay. Nope, nope, nope. Let's do this one instead. Okay, so that basically does what I wanted to in a bit of a clumsy way. To mark for deconstruction, I'm gonna have one location inbound here. This one will be will it be a one one or one two? It's, I think it's gonna be a one two train. So let's build this part. This part seems to be an excellent one two train location. That goes in here. This one and yeah, I wish I could craft it. What? I don't have any? Ugh. Now I can actually request stuff. So how about requesting some of these just because. And all of these are just busy getting removed. So I'm going to take this one and just good old assume that it works. And then I'm going to go up, 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 up here. How's the power? Power looks fine right now. And what else? Our uh, robots are 22,700 robots being used. I mean, I didn't think I would need so many robots, but uh, right now I'm kind of happy that we overbuilt them so intensively. This one is actually our science. You know, this presents the next little issue. Because I can't really start building anything unless this one is clear. And I mean, like, totally clear. Good. That's a problem. Oh, I don't even have any grenades anymore. Well, I do have grenades. So let's grenade a bit. Because who the hell needs all of this crap? This is unfortunately also soaking up my pollution. So it's a high likelihood that by removing all the trees, then my pollution will spread a bit more. Oops. And that should be fine. Okay, the only one thing that is actually a problem with this is the fact that I would like to be able to get... Okay, I was almost killing myself here. I would like to be able to get all of this iron out of this location. And currently that doesn't seem surely feasible. And now I let my own robots go. Well, I could if I... Holy shit, there's a biter in here. I just have to strike the biter. And you're like, where? No, it's in my room. It's now a dead biter. All right, we can expect that when we kill the first biter, there will be more. Ah, God damn. All right, um, let's see. They are generally on the outside. So that would be this one is going to be military science. I'll just take whichever one has military science and then we'll shuffle things around like so. 
that's gonna be military science and okay I can't even see anything get out of there you get out of there look at all this crap no no never mind all right so let's see there'll be three things coming in here those should be iron I'm gonna take them up here all right they're gonna go back and then go up and then so which things will it be it'll be coal iron no iron steel and copper yeah iron steel and copper will be coming in here that means the first thing we can and should build is actually the military part that one should be pretty straightforward these there'll be two of these and two and so six of the other ones right and like that These are going to be outputting like this. They're going to be inputting. <laughs> I will need a full belt of copper. Let's do that one. Iron, iron. The iron comes in here and then stops. Then copper comes in here and goes in. That's going to be the copper line and this one. Let's be that one plus that one. And then we're going to get an output line that goes out here. And this is where I, for some reason, I forgot this. Let's get some of these. Boom, copper, iron, this one, that means on this path, it isn't set yet, and I don't dare build out, build it out completely, but we gotta have some structure here, yes, iron, copper, or, you know what, we can actually do it, make even cooler, Mm -hmm. that's going to be iron why do we think that's a good idea because on the other side right there will be grenades damn it it's not even a good idea I thought it was a good idea because I don't want Mm, okay. Hold on. Think, damn you. Uh huh. This one has to be the output. Then this one could be the core. The iron goes in here. This one has to be, yep, and then it has to go, coal has to come in on the other side, so I'll just bring the coal in on this side, this is going to be coal. Iron goes in, and hey, look at that, logistics parts are working, nice. Slowly and surely they are building the stuff. Two, three, four. That's all we need. This is actually all we need. That one is the iron coming in. And this one will now be the mix belt. And I just need one of these to build a little location there for 1,000. Yeah. Piercing rounds. Yes. Do we also need it on the other side? Yes, we do. That will 
of the grenades. Yep. Okay. So what we have here is actually all we need, and that needs to go into a build location. All right. Military science should be pretty straightforward. We don't really need much. So it's one, one, two. Okay, so out here, that would be one. Actually, it can be exactly like it always is. One in, one in, one out. Stuff like this. This is our favorite build, so since it's our favorite build, it wouldn't be our favorite build if we didn't build it all the time. Got that one, and the other one is one, two, three. One, two, three. And again, input, input. And you know what? I might actually move the whole thing once it's built, just out of sheer spite. Let's grab, grab, grab. So should I make it closer to that one? I think I think I'd like to like to build it somewhere that actually could be there. This one coming straight from that. This one going straight up to. Oops. I have no idea if that's correct. But it's definitely going into that location where we can take something out of this book. Boom. Yeah. That's kind of Okay. I'm just redoing it. That thing. Cut that thing out and deconstruct this thing and then paste this one in. There. So that's the output side. That one will be the coal. I wonder if that can come up from here. It's gonna be a bit tight and doesn't matter. All right, so coal is for some reason a four wide. This one is luckily really easy. So one. Uh, this is already too many, so that should be fine. That's going to take what it needs. And now it's time to build, to build stations. So we have one unloading coal. Wow, they're still at it. They're still at it, removing these. That's okay. I don't know why that one's supposed to be there. And it, I'm really looking for, we're looking for the coal unload. That one is a coal unload. That's a bit ambitious, to say the least. Why exactly would I want this coal to be on such a big train? Because I don't want trains running around all the time. That's the, the, honestly the real answer. And you're going to go there. This one will be something else. It'll be... There's the military. Military there. Coal. Always always try to unload fast. And you know, this one. There, now they're all constrained a bit. And that will then be... Just have a normal unloader. 
Where's that? Where do we have a normal unloader? This is a nice unloader, right? That's a normal unloader. I mean, like, almost. Almost okay. That one goes out, and that one goes out here. Almost. Does that seem right? No, it doesn't. Then this one doesn't seem right either. So that's coal coming in. Now we need on the other side, this part. We're still, everyone's busy. Yeah, everyone's still busy. Now we need unloading location over here. Oh, we have a train that ran out. Damn, I don't want my trains to run out. Which one is it? It's a problematic one. Damn. Oh, this is also problematic as well because we are going to use one of those precious, precious location that's now underneath it. Okay, so what is that going to be? That's going to be steel because steel is the smallest and most insignificant of these. Here, so that's going to be a steel unloader. That's going to look like this. Boom. They can cross over here if they want. Steel unloader has to be on the inside of this belt because the outside is for the that one. I got to do that one. It'll look better like that. Good. That's actually okay. And now the next one will be copper. Now we need a copper unloader. This is a copper unloader and this is an iron unloader. Damn, can we just be, can we just copy both of these? Just, boom. And naming, that will be military steel. We just call things iron now. You don't have to call it plate. That's too long. There. That's easy. And, you know, we actually should be upgrading that one and that one. There we go. Is it now connected? New Kind of. Yes. No. Uh, mainly no. Still have all of this. And that's not working because... No, it's just working because just not working because we have that. Okay. This one was iron. Yep. And copper. That's gonna be more difficult to get. There. It's it's okay. So that's iron, copper, everything. And this one thing we're missing is actually the stone bricks. We're going to build all of it, but we are probably not going to see it going live yet. So this one, these two, lively ones. And that's going to be these ones in here. We also have to sort of cater for the fact that it's probably going to be better later on. There. And that's going to be stone walls. So, that one. Whoa, we lost our... Ah, man, that's just always. Can we request some of these? Maybe 400? How big should that be? 
Should that be a one train or a two train? I guess we just make it a two train. Like that. We'll make one of these. It seemed completely absurd that the coal is so big. Someone really should fix that. Ta-da! Everything is working now. Except we don't have all the stuff that we need. Woo! Uh, and we don't have the output as well. Where is the... Oh, yeah, the output is actually going out. Damn. So, let's see. Uh, these are not correct. This is coal. This one is... Stone brick. All right. Unfortunately, we won't be able to see that it comes online. Look how close we are. This is absurd. As soon as this fires up, we are going to aggro these... But whatever, um, it's going to be one of those challenges we just have to deal with. So, I'm going to leave it here. Thank you very much for watching. I'll be back next time where we will f issue a lot of trains to uh, service the, uh, the military science so we can get that up and running. And then we can also get the blue circuits, uh, blue science up and running. We got uh, another 618, so that should be enough to get the military going. And including some of the military research, such as... Uh, that one, that one, and then also that one, and then this one is a juicy one because that also increases by 90%. Oh, the rapid shooting speed. I don't want shooting speed. Who cares about shooting speed? That one, that one, and then comes the juicy one, that one, which is 90% cannon shell damage. That's the one we want in order to really use the tank to shoot down these with relative ease. Thank you for watching. I'll see you guys in the next episode. Until then, stay effective.